come back? Did Scotty McLeod disappear from your screens there? And has he come back? Do tell. I think it's very, very important. How is the time looking? Because you'll want me to go. Yes. <clears throat> well, so we've got about 15 minutes. Uh, so there we are. And uh, I think we're back live. Did we actually disappear there, though? Do tell me. And is the connection working? Let me know as well. John Gittens is watching. John, did you come back when the connection came back there, actually? Because I think for some reason, Scotty may have faded. Why? I don't know. Uh, but there we are. Probably just everything very, very busy, exceptionally busy. A happy New Year, says Gordon Bennett. Gordon Bennett. And uh, that's fantastic. Julianne's back. There you are. There's a wee tune for you. A wee see in the new year. There's Wadge just joined us. Happy New Year, Scotty, says Wadge. Dinky-doo, Wadge. Wadge is down south. Scotty, will you still love me tomorrow? Of course, I will love you all tomorrow. We're working again, says Christopher Reese. I'm not sure if he was talking about him or if he was talking about me. Time for a sip of tea. Seize the day. Now, this is your message for the new year, guys. <coughs> Pardon me, just cleaning the pipes there. What a wee chest infection, you know. Oh, and the telly has apparently been absolutely duff. So you'll be glad that Scotty McClue's live. Happy New Year, sir, says Douglas William Bryce. All the very best, and to you, Douglas William. That looked very hard, says Jarvis. Do you want to join our band, Scotty, says Julianne. Yes, I mean, I, I was in a boy band, actually. You might not believe I'm in a boy band. No direction. And um, keep your messages coming, and I will tell you what is happening for the rest of the evening for those of you who lost us there welcome back a very warm welcome back right round the world and uh, what's your new year's resolution says wedge i was just telling somebody earlier wedge i think i might not make a new year's resolution and then you've nothing to break so but you tell me what you think got a lovely lovely haircut from ms donnelly yesterday so there you go and uh, I think I might have been calling her the wrong name. So if Miss Donnelly's watching, come on. The Magic Tea, says Douglas William Bryce. Of course. A dinky do and a happy new year to you, Scotty, says Johnny Rook. I hope 2017 is happy, peaceful and prosperous to you, old pal. Slangeva. Slangeva to yourself, John. Absolutely slangeva. Mm. Well, that's a for good water. So there you are. Um, Ashley Smedley, a happy new year, Scotty. Happy new year, Scotty, says Robbie Proven. It's a carnival marching display band, Scotty. Of course it is. Happy new year from New Zealand, says Kimmy Wicks. Kimmy, lovely to hear from you. Are you north or south island? Let us know where you are. Are you, are you near Auckland? Touche, says Jarvis. Mr. Martin's trying to Skype in, Scotty, says Evan Thompson. Now, if you want to get onto Scotty McClue's YouTube channel and look up Scotty McClue Talks to Mr. Martin, you will get a smile. So there we are, a cheeky, cheeky man. Joanna K. Jackson's watching. Now, Joanna K. is in... Tell us exactly where you are, Joanna K. Come back again and tell us. Derek Payton's watching. Wellington, and in Wellington, the capital of New Zealand, says Kimmy Wicks, dinky do to you. I remember seeing a very, very, very uh, fine pipe band from Wellington. So there you are. They were tremendous. So they are a great pipe band. Happy New Year, Scotty. Loving your chat. It's just brilliant to listen to you. Later. Cheers, says Jim Stephen Gibb. Absolutely. I hope you've got the pipes out, Jim. And you're giving it Glen Calla Castle. Scotty, my New Year's resolution is to treat Tory voters like you'd treat an Egyptian date seller. Well, I hope you'd look after the date sellers. And uh, that's a date. John O'Rourke's watching Scotty. Have you ever been awake when you're sleeping? Well, no, Jarvis, but sometimes I will shut my eyes in front of the mirror just to see what I look like when I'm sleeping. Happy New Year, Scotty, says Steve Burrows. What does dinky-doo mean, says Wedge? Wedge 
It means, is all well with you and the world? It came from the Roman Emperor Zero, who stood up on one of the walls, and he went, dinky do everybody. And they all shouted back, dinky do Zero. Uh, G. Hamilton, a happy new year, my pal, says G. Dinky do to you, G. Lovely to hear from you. If you're phoning from around the world, of course, or you're in touch from around the world, do tell us exactly where you are calling from. It's very, very much appreciated. I think you might find we've got two videos tonight because for some reason it just faded in the middle there and left us. But keep your messages coming. It's a shout out show. Scotty McClure's Hogmanay Bash. It was first started in 1993 on Red Rose Radio in Preston. And it's gone on to great, great things. And here we are live on Facebook Live 25 years later. Is that not amazing? Uh, 1992, I started in Red Rose. And 25 years, this is the 25th year of the Scotty McClure Massive Mighty Megaphone in. If you see anything from Scotty McClure, then for goodness sake, make sure you share it. Tell 10 to tell 10. Mary T. Warner is watching. Dinky do to you, Mary T. Warner. Lovely, lovely to have you with us. Very distinguished lady there. We've got, this is absolutely incredible, folks. When you think we just started a few weeks ago <coughs> and it's become absolutely massive worldwide program. Far, far bigger than anything on the television or the radio. Okay, Scotty, you're in the last chance saloon. A happy new year to you and all my fellow Scotty fans and to my brother William. All the best, says Charles McLaughlin. <laughs> or McLaughlin. Scotty, what's your favourite Bothy ballad? My dad's was the Breeze of Dramelge or something like that. Well, we'll find out, Ian. I'll, I'll brush up on my Bothy ballads and I'll sing you one. Love to love your radio shows, Scotty. Great entertainment. You're mental, says Evan Thomas. Where did you get that from? Do I look as if I might not be the fool shilling? Right. Uh, Happy New Year, Scotty, says Mary T. Warner. I hope 2017, all your dreams and wishes come true. Think you do. Mary, there's talks going on at a very, very, very high level. Thanks, Scotty, says Charles McLaughlin. Not at all, Charles. A great pleasure my dear fellow a very big thank you to you i say it's very very important now we've only got a, a very very short time left folks so if you want to come on and have a chit chat please do so excuse me just a second oh my goodness more messages coming in coming in at a terrific rate tremendous what a fantastic show i mean bearing in mind this was just a wee experiment <coughs> McGlue pops up on Facebook Live, and here's everybody. What time are you on till, Scotty, says Steve Burrows? We're on to uh, half past 12, Steve, so we've got about another um, eight minutes or something like that. 20 minutes have flew in, says Louise Sullivan. They have flown in, Louise. So there you are. I'm just correcting you on your tenses. A touch of the grammarian about McClure there. Scotty, are you on a wheelbarrow, says Jarvis? I might well be Jarvis, yes, just the one wheel. Like the wee, the wee cock's barra chirping a wall in the shafts of the barra. Scotty B.T. have put a contract you on you. <laughs> That's right. Uh, 20 pounds a month. Uh, fantastic. Thomas Drake Horn's watching. Uh, fantastic stuff. Do you know what? I miss the steamy. It was always on on Hogmanay. Tony Roper's fabulous play. I know Tony. A wonderful, wonderful, talented man. And he was a great friend to Ricky Fulton when Ricky had a tough time, Ricky and Kate, uh, latterly in, in the latter years. And Tony Roper is a lovely, lovely, genuine character, wonderful man. And of course, he wrote The Steamy. And I remember um, taking some people to see The Steamy out in Airdrie. In Airdrie, absolutely. Uh, you should get your own online radio. That would be best, says David Russell. Believe it or not, David, this is much bigger than when we did the online stuff. Love you, says Alexander McCorn. Thank you, Alexander. What happens in the steamy, says Jarvis? Well, it's about the ladies in the laundry in days gone by, the Glasgow laundry, all taking their washing down to the steamy because they didn't have washing machines and everything. They put them in the old Belfast sinks and scrub them up with the washing boards. And of course, the patter's going on all the time. Talking about, there's a wee old lady that talks about giving her husband mince and tatties 
Uh, so there you are. Uh, can you give us a shout out to Louisa, please, Scotty, says Steve Burrows. Of course I can. There are plenty of steamers in Airdrie, says Evan Thompson. <laughs> Ah oh dear, Scotty, do you wish you was steaming? No, of course not. Not my style. Mm. That's awful good water. Keep up the good work, pal, says Paul MacArthur. Uh, fantastic. There's more goes on here. Uh, are you through yet, says Derek William Nicholl. No, Derek, for goodness sake, not at all. That was why they used to say that Scots people drank beer and whiskey, because if they just drank beer, they were foo before they were gassed. And if they just drank whiskey, they were gassed before they were foo. So they drank the two of them together. And that's when they were needing them, no feeding them, Scotty, when a centurion was a rank and no a tank. So there you are. There was two fish in a tank, and one turned to the other and said, I've never driven one of these before. Right, uh, lots happening. Scotty McClure's Hogmanay Bash. Can I thank all of you and say dinky do for joining me here on New Year? It's amazing to think that this has been a highlight with all the television and radio that's on. Scotty McClure's Hogmanay Bash is as popular as ever. Thank you, Scotty, says Steve Burrows. Thank you to you, Steve, and to everybody. We've got. Um, Four minutes, guys. So if you want to say hello and a happy new year to all your pals throughout the world, get typing, I say. And uh, get Skyping. We might take another Skype call. Um, thank you. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you to all of you. Scotty, were you ever a heavy, lazy paper boy? No, Jarvis, what I did, I used to go and get the American sailors on the Liberty ship. I was the cabin boy. That was my first job at the age of 12. You could have a casual job at the age of 12. I've enjoyed every minute of it, Scotty, says Louise Sullivan. Well, Louise, I've enjoyed every minute of broadcasting to you guys. I really have. Scotty, my niece has lost a gold engagement ring, and then a week later, she went to the same place, and lo and behold, inside the pie she ordered, there it was. Ian, I think you're talking absolute nonsense. You've obviously had a light refreshment. So there you are. Guys, if you've just joined us and you're wondering what on earth's happening to your Facebook Live, it's Scotty McClue, the world's favourite broadcaster, just here for you saying dinky-doo and seeing in the new year and saying a very happy new year to all of you for 2017. James Michael Harvey, a happy new year, Scotty, and dinky-doo. Mince, says Ian. <laughs> Have a great New Year, Scotty, says Steve. I will, Steve, because there's been very high-level meetings going on. I mean, this is not the time to discuss it, and I can't give anything away, but I think you'll be hearing a lot more of Scotty McClue in the New Year. So there you go. I make no apology for all the sharing on social media, of course, but I do apologise if it's been inconvenient to you. But share 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 and tell 10 to tell 10 it's lovely of you to like all the various things but if you can share them as well so if you see the name scotty mcclue on facebook on twitter on google plus on youtube on linkedin share it share it share it yes because we are building something very big and very very special i can tell you that now you get it, says Ian. Absolutely. So there you are. And um, where are the meetings on Ben Nevis, Scotty, says Evan Thompson. <laughs> Tremendous. Scotty, can you give a shout out to my 11-year-old who goes by the name of Croc? He doesn't believe you're real, says Derek William Nickel. Yes, yes, Croc, I am real. <laughs> So there you are, no problem at all. There's Craig McGee saying a happy new year. Happy new year to you, Craig. And uh, you're obviously a hungry boy tonight and a chatty boy. So there you are, that's marvellous. And um, so, does Croc believe I'm real now, Derek William Nicholl? I'll expect to hear from you. David Young, a happy new year, Scotty. See you soon, says the wonderful David Young, one of the finest hoteliers Scotland has ever known. So there you are, a tremendous man, David Young. So if you ever meet David Young, say dinky do from Scotty McClure. Scotty, Facebook's going to drop you because you're getting more famous. 
Well, we're bringing a lot of fame to Facebook as well. So I shouldn't think that will be a problem. You need to be on more than once a week, says Steve Burrows. Andy Rutherford's watching. Andy's at a bit of a tough time. I think he was at the Hoppy. Is that right, Andy? Uh, but uh, but you're back with us. Dinky do to you. I say Andy Rutherford, a very fine broadcaster indeed. Tremendous all these wonderful professional people who have joined us on Facebook Live. This programme is finding its feet and it is really awesome, it really is. And remember, I'm talking with a wee bit of experience, 35,000 hours of live broadcasting to date. Uh, so there we've got that. So Andy, if you want to tell us what's happening, then that would be great. Now, I showed you earlier, I'll see and show you again. This is what happens when you put Scotty McClue on the radio. Can you see that, guys? There's the programs going along there. And when you bring that back, there's Scotty McClue, right? That's what happens when McClue goes on the radio. Uh, Giuseppe Bacchetti has just shared the video. Oh, yes, guys, can we have a massive share? This is going to go viral, Scotty. Well done, says Evan Thompson, guys. Send it viral. Do it now. Three kisses from Jarvis. Thank you, Jarvis. You're, you're quite a romantic person, aren't you? Here's to another 35,000, mate says John O'Rourke. Scotty, how come there's never any Welsh people on? Is Wales still there? We've had lots of Welsh people on tonight. We said to them Yaki Da and Nos Da and wished them a Happy New Year in Welsh. So that was wonderful stuff. Uh, so there's plenty of Welsh people and I am working on my Welsh so I can speak to you. You know what I'm saying. Uh, right, well, says Jarvis, yes. Michael McGuigan and three others have just shared the video. Can we have a massive sharing of the Scotty McClue Hogmanay bash right now, my loves? Thank you very much. And we'll have to go. I wonder if I can manage another tune for you. Uh, a quick good new year. <laughs> all the very best for 2017 love and blessings from scotty mcclue and please don't be sad i send you joy and joy and joy share this program send it around the world and i'll see you all uh, in fact i'll see you all tomorrow night with scotty mcclue's new year special at 10 o'clock sharp join me then until then dinky do and a happy new year See you, loves. <laughs>